Hi, boys and girls. I'm Indiana from Sarah Christian Church, and I am so glad that you're joining us here today. We are going to have so much fun as we talk about our feelings and how God wants us to act when we feel certain ways. And we get to meet my special friend, Kelly Toolbox. Let's all wave and say hello to Telly right now. Hey, Telly. Hey, everyone. My name is Telly Toolbox, and I'm so glad you're here to be Builder Buddies with me today. We work hard to help all of our friends. Before we can get to work, we have to make sure we're dressed and ready. Everyone put on your hard hat and buckle on your tool belts. Now that you're dressed, everyone stand up to sing a song. You can sit back down. Builder Buddies, it seems that we have a problem on the job site today. Let's take a look. Oh no! Look at Chef Sam the food truck. His feelings may be getting out of control. Chef Sam needs to stop and name what he is feeling. Builder Buddies, do you think Chef Sam looks scared or happy? Scared! Chef Sam does look scared. Now that he's stopped and named what he is feeling, it's time to look around and see what is making him feel that way. Builder Buddies, do you see anything that could be making Chef Sam feel scared? I think I see it. Do you? Chef Sam has added some brand new food to his menu, but it looks like no one is in line yet. Chef Sam is scared that no one likes his new food. Now that we've helped Chef Sam stop to name his feelings and look around to see what is making him feel that way, it's time to listen. Builder Buddies, click on your listening ears and get ready to hear a story that's sure to help us deal with any feeling that comes our way. Whenever you don't know what to do with your feelings, the best thing to listen to is a story from God's Word. Do my builder buddies know what God's Word is? The Bible! That's right! Long ago, God's people kept doing the wrong things and not doing what God wanted them to do. So, for seven years, God allowed their enemies to rule over them. God's people were so scared that they hid inside caves in the mountains. Can you show me how God's people looked when they were scared? Let me see you all make a scared face. 
You do look scared. Now, their enemies, the Midianites, were so mean and were destroying all the food that God's people planted. So finally, God's people prayed and asked God for help. On the count of three, say help, like God's people did when they prayed. One, two, three. Help! Good job, builders. Because God was with his people, he heard their prayers and sent an angel to a man named Gideon. Gideon was scared that the Midianites would come take away his food, so he was hiding as he prepared wheat. That's when the angel of the Lord appeared to him. The angel said to Gideon, Mighty warrior, the Lord is with you. Gideon did not feel very mighty. Remember, he was hiding because he was scared the enemy would come take his food. So Gideon asked the angel why God's people were having so many troubles. The angel told Gideon that the Lord would give him the strength to save Israel. But Gideon was still scared. So Gideon asked God to do something that would show that he was really going to help Gideon save the people. Gideon put a piece of wool on the ground outside his cave. Before Gideon went to sleep, he asked God to make the wool wet and the ground around it dry. If God did this, Gideon would know that God was with him and he wouldn't be scared to do what God wanted him to do. So Gideon went to check the wool early the next morning. The ground was dry and the wool was so wet that Gideon was able to squeeze so much water into a bowl. But Gideon was still feeling scared. So he asked God to do one more thing. He set out the wool again and asked God to make the wool dry and the ground wet. Builders, do you think God made the wool dry and the ground wet? Yes! You got it! The next morning, Gideon saw that the ground was wet and the wool was dry. Now Gideon was sure that God was with him and would give him the power to do what God wanted him to do. When Gideon was scared, God was with him. If you are feeling scared, you can pray and ask God to help you because he is with you too. Thanks for listening. Here's one of my special tools to help you remember what you heard from God's word today. When you're feeling scared, God is with you. You can use me to smash your fears away as you remember that when I'm scared, God is with me. Builder Buddies, let me hear you say this after me. When I'm scared, when I'm scared, God is, God is, with me, with me. Chef Sam doesn't have to feel scared because God is with him. God loves Chef Sam. And God promises to always be with him and help him not feel scared. And I'm sure Chef Sam will have a line of hungry workers ready to try his new food as soon as it's lunchtime. You see, Builder Buddies, when we stop, look, and listen, we will see that God is greater than our feelings and that he knows everything. Everyone stand up and let's sing a song about that now. I can't stop and think about what I feel. I can't look for help and see if what I feel is real. I can listen to hear what God has got to say. Then I can move along and have a good day. God is greater. Greater. Greater than our feelings And he knows He knows Everything God is greater 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 than our feelings And he knows He knows Everything God knows everything I can't stop And think about what I feel I can look for help and see If what I feel is real I can listen to hear what God has got to say Then I can move along and have a good day God is greater 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 than our feelings And He knows He knows Everything God is greater Greater 
greater than our feelings and he knows he knows everything god knows everything i can't stop and think about what i feel i can look for help and see if what i feel is real i can listen to hear what god has got to say then i can move along and have a good day then i can move along and have a good day you sounded great now it's your turn to help a friend like you You did it! And the next time you're feeling scared, just remember that God is with you.